Okay guys, Akumaldo Crypto here with another Bitcoin update. So guys, I would like to start with this chart here. It's a it's a old it's a old count. Uh it's now invalidated, but I would like to explain something here. This is uh Bitfinex. Uh however that may be, I'm going to use it uh, the same way even though I don't like it because Bitfinex is 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 uh, f 200 bucks above the market price, which is not a good sign. <laughs> um, so, we this was a situation, right? WX, then we will, we will have this Y here. This was my count. We would finish this with a, a B, C, D, E, and then we would go up, okay? This was a, a scenario where we had, where we, we had, a double uh, 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 double combo instead of a triple combo okay a double combo ABC W ABC X and then an ABC and the 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 last wave would be a triangle ABC D E for a Y and then we would go up this would be a, a simple finish for this correction okay and we fail okay not we fail but the market the market took another direction okay so then we need to change this was possible this was within the rules of Elliott waves okay this was within the principle we were not breaking any rules here so and this is what is beautiful about Elliott waves we need to react it's a, it's a framework that we use to understand the market and to react to the market okay so if you're not comfortable with with the changes of the market or if you're not comfortable with the changes that we propose when we use a framework like uh, Elliott Waves so you're not prepared to be a trader because you need to be reacting to the market okay um, okay I I, 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 I just I, I thought that it would be interesting to show you guys how beautiful it is a discount and it, it just failed okay it would be nice to just go up like this but it it didn't happen okay we have a, a different story um, I story that would do this would be it, it's po it was possible but it's not it and it was likely but the, the market took another path so then what we do we need to think about it okay remember this was an no no this was an alternate count uh, it was not my primary count my primary count is a triple combo but this is really likely nonetheless okay this was really, really likely nonetheless sorry um, so and then what we have now uh, it's it's the same thing the same old story this is my chart we, have, we are now 336 days in this correction one year Ooh. one year indeed one year now right oopsie yes one year guys one year in this correction and we have we have hit the target that I proposed guys what target this target here we nailed it remember I proposed that we would get to this target here and see we just got we just hit it and react okay so this now now what i think that this might be a wave three or a wave five depending on on how it reacts okay but we hit it this is this was a minus this is a minus 360 percent minus 618 percent target okay a strong support again it's a, it's acting as a support we had a huge reaction upon touching it okay so it it's everything according to planned here okay this is my my count okay this is my triple combo w x y x and then we have an a b inside of this b we have the triangle that took us down to this c okay and in my in my opinion in my view this is just the beginning okay we have to finish this is the 127 20 percent of the extension for this c so this is not the, the end of the correction okay guys 
This can't be if you if you assume that this is an A, B, and a C. Okay, some analysts are counting this as the end of the of the correction. This was the end. This was the bottom. Somehow the bottom. I, I don't think so. Uh, we are gonna take a look in deep about this possibility, but it's not as likely as this thing here, as this, as the market going down and getting to lower targets, as I'm proposing here. Okay, and why? It's a re really simple why, guys, because we broke this huge support that we have been holding since December. This was a key region. Okay, I, I have said that in previous videos. I said that now in my preview, in my last video. When we broke with confidence this resistance, no, I'm sorry, this support here, then it's a, it's like a, a, the last nail in the coffin, right? The, it's bear market, don't forget that. Okay, bear market, see the cross here. We are now reacting, but we are below the 100 EMA for the first time in the weekly chart, okay? And I think, I really, I, 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 it's not a coincidence that we have here the 200 EMA at the 4K level, which I said would be a, a last target for us. I think that we're gonna touch it. Okay, I don't, I don't see, when we, when we have a pattern like this, a triangle, and we break it, it's not likely that we're gonna go up and, and just reverse like this. We broke to the downside. So the market is expecting more, uh, expecting price here, uh, expecting targets to the downside, not targets to the upside of the, the, the triangle. This is really important to notice. Okay, so this is my target. This is my, my primary count and it's my count. I, I don't have a, an alternate count. Uh, because honestly, this is clear cut for me, clear, crystal clear. So um, let's take a look. This is the two hour chart. So I was proposing that this is a three. Then we are now doing a four here, and then we would have a five here going down. But I I assume that this might be the end of it. Okay, this might be the end of it, and then we have a four here, and then a five. Let let, let me just check. If it flies, yes, this would be a. I would expect if this was a five year, a really nice reaction here. And we let's see the volume. We haven't had a huge volume here, as I would expect. We had some volume here, but not here as it's decreasing. OK, it's a sideways movement. So, but what is interesting, nonetheless, is that we got to the target exactly as I said, minus 23.60%. This was extension, 423.60%. And bam, exactly at the 52, 52, uh, 5200 target, okay? Uh, 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 slightly above it, but the target was hit. So nice, isn't it? Now, a reaction, but I don't think we have finished it. But it, when I say I don't think we have finished the wave uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 here, we haven't finished this, this motive impulse wave down here or this ending diagonal. I, I don't see a diagonal here, but uh, when, I, when I say that it haven't finished, uh, I need more data. I need to see if, the ha if, if it have, if, if it had finished indeed, I need to see it because when we don't have such a reaction, such a strong reaction, because I would expect something like this, getting a, a, a strong reaction going, uh, really attracting buyers here. And then of course, sideways movement around this region here, around this resistance here, I would expect here, not here. That's why I think this is a four way, a fourth wave and then we would ha we will have another push and would we'll have a, a huge week here and then we're gonna have a reaction okay we are now put in wave four in my in my assessment of this movement here okay but it doesn't change a lot it doesn't change because we hit 
we have hit this target here, which was the first target. Next target is 4,700, okay? If you have been following me, it's money, okay? It's a, it's a good chart, okay? So ABC, not a great deal. ABC, not a great deal. I don't know how to count this differently, okay? I don't know how to count this differently. I don't see it differently. I, if you are, if you see some uh, analysts saying that this is a, this is the end of the correction. This this is a C, but this is the end of the correction. It doesn't it doesn't it it, 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 it doesn't make any sense because if you if we have our extension true here, and we extend our wave A through B, what we have is that. 100% is exactly at this support, okay, oopsie, let me, exactly at this support where I am calling the 4700, 40, okay, and the other support, the other, uh, oh, my, my kitty cat, oh, don't do that, <laughs> sorry guys, um, the other the other target is here down 127 20 percent which is a sweet spot for our wave C it's here at 4k so uh, how are you gonna tell that a wave C is gonna be so short this is gonna be like less than 100 it, percent it's it's not impossible we would have some kind of uh, of course the wave C is going to uh, below the level of a wave a which is fine, which is, but we would expect at least 100%, okay? I would expect at least 100%. So 4,700 is a reality, is really likely, okay? At least. And then we have this huge target here, minus 23, 60%. So it's it's likely that we stop here, but it's not likely that, stop, that we stop here, okay? Basically, that's what I'm saying. And then, of course, we would... Act, this support would become a resistance and if we go to this 4k okay but C cannot just end like this like really fast that's the problem guys we upon bro upon breaking this movement here breaking this movement here this support here this trend line here when uh, now we are in the downside well now we are we have established a new lowest low of the year we are now in the in the in the downside we are in the in the the bottom of the triangle not in the in the upside of the triangle so we need to expect that the market is going to look for lower targets and not just jump to the other side of the triangle it's not the market doesn't the it's it's really unlikely when we analyze markets, when we break a triangle to just jump to the other side of the triangle like this. It takes time. The market took a decision here, a really, a really difficult decision. That's why we had a triangle here, an ABCDE, a triangle that took like 60 days. Remember, since September here, since almost August, right? It was more than 60 days. A bit more than 60 days to take this decision to go down. Okay, to dump here, and then we we are now in this process of going down. To, of course, we're gonna have sideways movement every time we have a dump. Every time we we have a, a strong and decisive movement, afterwards we're gonna have a sideways movement. That's the nature of the market. Okay, so so far so good. Okay, we are in the we are we have hit this target here, and now. You can, if you take your profit here, you can take your profit now, or you can wait more to get a, a, a lower target to take your profit, or you take your profit now, and then you reload here at this resistance, because we are gonna get to this resistance. This is not a question of if, but when. It's gonna take some time, because of, uh, if we have another leg going down here, we are gonna react to this wave two here afterwards. Okay, so this is a one, two, three, just to label it, four and five. This is my count. Okay, guys. Let me take this. Um, okay. If this is a one, it's finished. 
we are gonna need some kind of reaction now. If it's not a wave one yet, we're gonna have another week going down here and then a wave two. Okay, simple like that. And we we don't indeed we don't have a, I I cannot see this as a wave C just finishing and then going up. If this happens, of course I'm gonna have my this is my stop loss here. Okay, actually my stop loss is right here. Okay, right here at the the top of uh, at the bottom of this triangle here. This is my stop loss. Six 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 one fifty. Remember that resistance, right? Six one fifty. So six one ninety. It's here. So this resistance here. Six one hundred because it was a key point for Bitcoin. So if we break above it, this is my my stop loss. Okay. But I don't believe it. It's uh, I don't believe it, and I don't feel like it because we are in the downside of this triangle, and we are looking for lower targets here. The market is looking. Okay, um, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. If you have a different count, if you have an alternate count, I'm really happy. I would really be. I would re. I would be happy to see it. If you share with me, I'm gonna. I'm gonna uh, discuss about it and I'm gonna give you guys my my two cents about it and thanks for watching as always and give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't joined us in our crypto trade educational Institute please consider doing so the link is in the description okay and join me uh, follow me on my Twitter <laughs> Thank you very much. Have a wonderful weekend. Cheers. Bye-bye.